Hey guys, it's back from Reclined Gamers here, bringing you Let's Play Pokemon Emerald, episode 28. Sorry guys for the lack of Let's Plays lately, I've been kind of busy, and I don't know, like on my free time that I've had, I just haven't felt like doing Let's Plays. But I'm feeling pretty good right now, so I think I'm gonna do a Let's Play, and I am. So if you walk into this house near the end of the city or town, you uh, find a dude inside, this huge fat dude taking up two chairs. He really needs to go on Weight Watchers, but whatever. Uh, he says, oh, I'm looking for heart skills. If you give me a heart skill, you'll get a new move. And he's pretty much a move tutor. You can learn old moves. And then later on in that route, if you go into the house that I just walked in, like a minute ago and you talk to the kid that I just talked to about like a few seconds ago he will give you dig that's a good TM and his brother is digging a tunnel and he gives you a little hint about fossils somewhere in the desert we'll be getting to those later on but for now we're going to continue on route 114 and here's a fisherman if anybody challenges me I'm there Arg. I'm gonna call him Pirate Nolan. Yark, I'm Pirate Nolan. Ye be fighting me, Barboach, in the wide open seas, Yark. And when I say wide open seas, I mean the lake that I'm fishing in, or a pond, Yark. And then I own his Barboach. And he's like, Yark, what are you doing to me, you matey? I'll make ye walk the plank. I like ye battle, but that doesn't aw. I, I went too fast, I'm sorry. I wish I could have told you my heroic pirate speech. Okay, so now I'm gonna start training file like a G6 and take an item from HM Slave since his pickup ability that's really, really useful. I'm so happy. And then uh, I'm gonna run over here, talk to this man standing next to a Poochiana, and he will give you a special item called a TM05. It's a real. It's not that good. I mean, it's TM Roar. It's good for competitive, but it's not really good in this gen because Stealth Rock hasn't come into play yet. But there's always spikes, and is, did Toxic spikes come into play? Yet? I'm not sure. Uh, I really should check this out. But whatever. Okay, so now let's continue, and I g and I go off to the right over here, and then you have two trainers that want to battle. I'm gonna send out fly like a G6 and Leonard. I'm gonna use a wing attack on Barboach. So that's gonna do a lot of damage, almost one shot kill it, but not that. But it still lived. It's gonna use a mud sport. Not really gonna help. Then the Nuzlocke is gonna use Nature Power, which is gonna turn into Swift. Nature Power is just how it sounds. It's a move that. Uh, depends on the, uh, on the, how do I explain this? Nature power is a move that takes the power from the environment around him and turns it into a randomized move. Like if it's a plain area, it turns into swift. If it's a rocky area, I think it turns into earthquake. No, no, that's desert area. It turns into earthquake. I think nature power, uh, the other one is rock slide, but I'm not sure. Don't take my word for it. All I'm know, or it could be, yeah. All I know is desert is earthquake, and a plains is swift. No way, and uh, like forest areas is stun spore. Uh, no clue. But after you beat them, then you get a special item called energy powder. It's a cool item. Then we're gonna continue and go on this bridge. Then this fisherman's gonna be like, "Yar, why you beat up me, brother? My name is Claudie. Claude." Sorry. <laughs> okay, and Claude sends a Magikarp. We've already seen Magikarps before. They're terrible. Let's just kill it. And it's dead. Ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Okay, now Claude is going to send out Goldeen. And it's very terrible. I hate Goldeens with a passion because they are terrible water types. I, would ne I will never have one on my team ever. Ever, 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 never, ever, sh never, clever. Uh, I have a lever. <sighs> Why am I really weird today? I don't know. I feel off. I feel really off. I think it's because I didn't get that much sleep last night. But besides that, I feel eh, eh, okay. But I feel like doing all this fun. 
uh, sorry if this isn't the most entertaining episode, guys. I've been, I'm just like, it's my first one back. I'm gonna be uploading another one soon. I'm, pro I'm gonna try and stick to a video a day. I'm gonna try my hardest to stick to that. And just so you guys know, I'm pretty sure you already know this, but I'm not live streaming. I wish I was. Because I need, like, better stuff for that. I need something to hold up this mic, because I got a better mic, and it's a rock band mic. <laughs> uh, it's fun. But I need, like, something to hold that up while live streaming, so. I'll be doing that eventually. Probably my second or third Let's Play, I'll start live streaming. But for now, I'm just going to keep playing Emerald. I'm still debating on my se what my second Let's Play should be. I don't know why I'm thinking about that right now. I mean, I'm only at the... Third, no, I'm about to go to the fourth gym in Emerald. I'm only like halfway done with it. Not even halfway because the, the last half is like so long. It's like I'm only like a third of the way through the game, and yet I'm thinking about my second and third Let's Plays. But I don't know. I want you guys to tell me what Let's Plays I should do because I want the, ma the majority votes decision or whatever. Right now I'm thinking about Minish Cap and Pokemon Crystal. I'm not sure. Or Pokemon Prime or White. I'm not sure. Actually, no, I don't want to do White because a uh, White and Black 2 are coming out soon. And I want to do a Let's Play on that. That's what me and everybody on this channel is going to do right now. We're all going to, like, do a separate Let's Play for Pokemon uh, Black 2 and White 2. And we're just, I guess we're, we may just start out with different starters. No clue what we're going to do there. But we'll figure something out. And I get $288. Sweet. Okay, I'm gonna skip that battle. Okay, guys, for the next few battles, I'm gonna be speeding it up for time management purposes. So, okay, now we're battling Tyra and Ivy. Th uh, they're gonna send out Graveler and Roselia. Graveler is the evolution of a Geodude. And it, uh, it's a lot more bulky, but still it is easy enough to take down. Not as good as its last evolution, but whatever. And Roselia is gonna be a little bit time consuming, but we took it out. And Leonard goes to level 19. Okay, now we are going to go inside this house. And do you remember that girl that was standing in front of the PC in our last Let's Play? I don't expect you to because that was a while ago and I haven't uploaded a video since. But she was standing in front of the PC and she said to visit her on her house. If you visit at her house, she gives you a special item called the Lotad doll. That's like an item that you could put in your secret base that I explained in one of my earlier episodes. I'm going to be making a secret base later in the game, so don't worry about that. I'll come back to you on that. And if I ever forget, just remind me. But, okay, after we get out there, we find this camper dude. And he has a team of Sand True and Nuzleaf. Not very difficult. Pretty easy to get. Or beat. And then we find a... Ooh, I want to battle with the Pokemon. That's what this creeper in the, in the dinosaur costume says. Or Charmander or whatever kind of costume says. But, whatever... Now we're going to be battle. I this is gonna be a kind of long battle, biting the crap out of Aaron's, which are not very effective. <laughs> I have a friend named Aaron. Uh, I'm gonna start being like Aaron. That's a Pokemon name. <laughs> I'm gonna like just go up to him and be like that. Okay, so then um, there's a special item behind this rock. If you break it, you find it. It is called. It's called a protein. I'm pretty sure proteins increase attack. Wait. There's proteins, calciums. Wait, yeah, calcium. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, proteins, calciums, iron, and zincs, carboses, and hit point ups. Those items increase one uh, stat by 10 EVs. We were talking about EVs. I'll explain this later on, but they're just good to have. They're good to have and good to use. They, they're really expensive in stores, though. You can only really buy them in the department store, which we'll get to late later. And right now we beat this trainer dude, and he gives you the Pokemon Pokenav number. Now we're going to be going down here, and he's like, "If you're not prepared, you should not be up in the mountains." And I'm just like, "Yo, happy hiker guy! I'm fully prepared. I'm going to own your team, and I'm going to use Wing, wing Attack and Ember, even though Geodude's a uh, Ground type. I don't know why I did that. I think it was just because I don't know. But whatever." Uh, should I use, yeah, I'm gonna use Bite on Jude just to get it out of the picture, because Rock Slide's gonna be annoying. Okay, so the Meryl's gonna use Tail Whip, I'm going to Ember, why did I Ember the Meryl? Why would I do that? I don't know, oh my god, what's wrong with me? Okay, then it's gonna use Water Gun on, uh, on 
Leonard that's going to be super effective. Still not going to knock it out, but so that's really good. Leonard has a lot, is really, really bulky, which I like. Or it could just be Marl's a really, really bad Pokemon. I'm not sure. But uh, now this hacker's like, you're supposed to shout Yodle Hee Ho! Since it doesn't echo here. Yodle Hee I love this hiker guy. He's so cool. He's like, Yodle Hee Ho! And I'm just like, oh crap! Used by. Okay. That was close. I could have died there. I thought I was going to die! Oh no! Okay. So then I beat him, and he's just like, Yodle Hee Ho! Okay, guys, end of the episode. I will upload another one soon. Goodbye, my friends. I will talk to y'all later.